It's Radic fishing on a road trip. Heading down to the Florida Keys. We're almost to Key Largo now. Took a wrong turn heading to Grand Isle and here we are. Coming over the bridge, heading on to Key Largo. US 1 South. Passing over the Whale Harbor Bridge, getting on to uh, Isla Mirada. Actually, Matacumbi. Look how pretty the water is. Spent many a day spear fishing under that bridge, catching tropical fish. Coming over tea table by Bud and Mary's. Rain out in the back country. Going over the Indian Key Bridge. Watch where I'm going. Crossing channel number two. Getting ready to get on the long key in a little bit. See off in the distance. Getting on the Long Key Viaduct here on the south end of Long Key, Long Key Channel. People diving right by the bridge. Look how pretty. Old bridge is to the left of us is a catwalk for fishing. That's a diving lure. It's got a little lip, so it's. Oh, I thought it was a uh, top water. Yeah, it's not. Oh, there's a lot of grass in here. Looks like something moving out there. So this is where she was catching the snook, Alan? Yeah, she was kayaking. Oh, see, you got power pro. That can, that can do stuff that's impossible. So the keys are being overrun with iguanas. Got one sitting on this leaf right here on this palm tree. So green iguana. Just checking out looking at me. That's a small one. All right. So they went out in the Gulf Stream today trolling in the Boston Whaling. Didn't catch anything trolling there, caught a small red grouper bottom fishing on the reef, but it's so hot they come in. So it's this evening, we're in a little lagoon here, and I just threw out a little hard tail on a circle hook and caught about a four or five foot nurse shark. So it only took about two or three minutes to get a hit. So let's see if erratic fishing can, can match my last catch. <laughs> wow, look at that. He's caught himself eight feet. All right. Well, hopefully it's not a sunfish, then people will start swearing like in that other video. Yeah. <laughs> He's got a mono, uh, well, a, what, a fluorocarbon leader. Yeah, I think it's fluorocarbon. 50 pound. A little sharky shark? Feels like it. No. It's a ray. No, so if it was a ray, back. that pole would be bent. No, small ray. It's Doing the same thing the one I caught. I hooked him over there and he started running out the channel. Oh yeah. It's a little shark. Yeah, he's smaller than the one I had, so we won't get my hook back. Oh yeah. A little nurse shark. That's the perfect size for eating. There you go. Come on, Rick. Can you imagine? Look, he hit himself on that. Why did I eat that? Why did I eat that? Hey, I'm gonna hold your rod. What's wrong with me? I can't believe I eat that hook. Hey bud, we'll let you go. Don't worry. Good little fight. Yeah. Did he swallow the hook down or you can get it? I might be able to find it. Yeah, roll it out. Flip him on his back. Rub his belly. Yeah, pet him, pet him for a little bit. Yeah, you Put should be able to sleep. roll that one out. <laughs> that's a nurse shark, commonly referred to as a finger shark because that's usually about how much they take. They will suck the dipper right out of you. It's true. You gotta roll it out. Don't worry 
about it, Eric. He'll be dead in a minute. It won't matter. <laughs> <laughs> God, he's a feisty little guy. Yeah, they're slipping. <laughs> if somebody was had you by the gums and was trying know, to I... <laughs> held underwater, would you be sitting there? There it is. There it is. Roll that bad boy. There you go. Yeah, he's wrapped about 80 times. Yeah. Did you get him? Oh, yeah, look, he, okay, there you go. Give him a little. Give him a shove out there. All right, catch and take release. Him the tail, take him out there. Give him a little R&R. &R. Yeah, watch out, though. They, they, they <laughs> come right out. Uh, get, get him behind <laughs> it. Get him in front of the dorsal fin with one hand on his back. Like right there, yeah. And give him a yeah, shove out. I think he got a great white there. <laughs> Hey, I'll, uh, give him a little hey, look, I'll get more hits on the video if you get bit. <laughs> <laughs> He's good, dude. There you go. Now try to catch the one that's got my tackle in him. The, the great thing about a nurse shawl, he'll come right back and bite Oh, yeah. Again. You'll catch him again in 10 Oh, minutes. I caught one one time that had a, it looked like a crow's nest, a little squirrel yeah. nest. It was so much monofilament so all around his mouth mm -hmm. that he just, he bought and cuts a bit so many lines and get them all. No, well, I, was, I go down. I Had a bite on this one again. Yeah. This small, whatever it is. It's kicking kind of funny. If it's a shark, it's a little bitty one. But he's doing the same thing. Now he wants to go up current. You got the pliers with you, huh? Yeah, I got them on the pocket. That's what it is, a little nurse shark. Yeah. It's not the same one either. That's how to be a little easier with that red hook. It's not, not as deep either. Let's see if I can get him to roll over here. No. Hold on one second. Yeah. Get a grip. Yeah. Hold them upside down for a second. That usually kind of tranquilizes them. <laughs> I see it's working, huh? Yeah, real good. I got it. Don't, it ain't going nowhere. He'll get it. He'll get go. He'll go. Adios. <laughs> so we went trolling out on the Gulf Stream the last two days in the whaler and uh, nothing. Eric picked up one grouper back over here in the little lagoon by the campground and we're throwing some cut ballyhoo out and see if we pick up any bites on it. So I'm just tapped it, Eric. All right, hooked up. Cut ballyhoo. You don't mind me filming, huh? Yeah, you're looking like Adonis, you know. I wonder if. Yeah. <laughs> I want to. Hopefully, he's. Uh, hopefully, you're under mine. I think I am looking at the line. It looks like I'm on the Yeah, I don't. I don't see mine moving at all. What you got? Another little shark? That's what it feels like the way it's moving around. Oh yeah, I can see it over there now. Oh, that's a big one, boy. <laughs> oh, 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 watch him. <laughs> I get the pliers. Yeah. What kind of guy? Oh, nurse shark. Pull him up a little further. Yeah. Run, run, run. 
<laughs> oh, wait, he's got time. <laughs> how, how hooked is this one? You gonna get him? He's from Arizona, so he don't see the. Oh, okay, oh, yeah. yeah. I've been trying to show him. We've been doing much fishing. They went out trolling the last yeah. two days and didn't do I'm anything. I'm surprised you come during the day like that. We caught a bunch the other evening. Did you? Yeah, a little nurse shark, you know. If he's got it well, too deep, we'll just, shark. yeah. He's actually not that big. Uh, Maybe a little, no. bit, little bigger. If he's got it too deep, we'll just cut the leader and... Yeah. Yeah. Can you see him yet? Yeah, just cut it and we'll... There you go, release him. Catch and release. It only took about five minutes. <laughs> five minute fight? Well, no, just we've only been here about five minutes. Yeah. All right. We're two to two on these nurse sharks, so here we go. This The next one's the tiebreaker. Curry Hammock State Park, fishing in the lagoon. All right, all right. He just he just hooked a tarpon. He's got a fish on right here. Let him have some slack and run. Oh, 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 oh! He jumped and spit it, dude. On film. <laughs> oh, oh. I don't know, that's 40 something pound though. No, that's what they do. They jump and flip and spit. Yeah, no kidding. Look at that. Oh! Oh! Well, we just got the shock of our life. We're sitting here playing, figure we'll catch a couple nurse sharks, maybe a little black tip, goof off, pick up a couple little mangrove snappers and a monster tarpon. Picked up dead ballyhoo off the bottom. Made two jumps and spit the hook. He'll come back. <laughs> we had just seen him roll out in the middle and he cast out to the air where he was rolling and boom, he picked it up. That's crazy. Well, after the tarpon hook set and lost today, come back with some good, good quality hooks and new, uh, new ballyhoo baits right at the magic hour. I'm trying to get this bait on, I'm going through my finger. Alrighty, back to reality, back in Louisiana. I just made a three-day road trip down to the Florida Keys. I grew up there all the way from about 68 to about 1980. And uh, love it down there, have a lot of memories, and I love to go back and fish. If you've never been to the Florida Keys, it's a fantastic fishing destination. Um, you don't have to have a boat to catch fish. As you see in this video, we did best off the bank in the evenings and in the mornings with just cut bait cut cut uh, hard tail jacks and cut ballyhoo catching sharks hook the tarpon you know catch snappers barracudas all kind of stuff we had three days of pretty windy weather they tried trolling in the Gulf Stream for two days nothing but did catch a red group of reef fishing so fantastic time in the Florida Keys now it's back to reality my Louisiana marsh fishing till the next video get out there and go fishing